delayed again. A new methadone clinic is open, but it's still not offering all of its services just yet. Good evening, everyone. Catholic Health opened this new clinic in Amherst last month. But the clinic is not giving out methadone to its patients. News 4's Shannon Smith found out why tonight. Shannon? Don and Jackie, many patients were told this summer methadone treatments would start at the Amherst location in about four to six weeks. But I'm told they haven't started yet because of a new electronic record system. He kept trying different programs, different treatments, and he kept saying, I need something else. So when Joe Wojtovich heard the new methadone clinic had opened in Amherst, he was relieved his son would get treatment closer to home. The original time they weren't sure, they said, well, maybe we'll open it up in July. And then was it August? Uh, they weren't sure on the distribution. The Catholic Health Facility, which opened in August, offers counseling, primary care, and methadone based treatment. It blocks the effects of heroin and also reduces the the need for it uh, psychologically. But those treatments haven't started just yet. Vojtovich wants to know why. The politicians make a big issue about it being uh, an emergency, uh, something of uh, great importance, and they were going to try to push it through a little quicker. And I don't see that urgency. Catholic Health says when the Amherst location initially opened in August, the plan was to allow more time to move current counseling from its previous location on Sheridan Drive. A rep says distributing methadone requires a certain process, including a new electronic medical record system. Vojtovich says he understands, but just wants those who need the help to know why there's a delay. I could see where it might be a hindrance. I work in computers and I've seen other system go in, especially with the state, where they do have quite a bit of difficulty getting in place. The hospital explains in a statement saying the EMR system we are implementing will work twofold, supplying the physician prescribed dosage and tracking the patient's medical records. Due to the intricacy of this system, we have had a slight delay in implementation. I'm told methadone distribution is expected to start October 15th for at least 250 patients, but I'm told that number is expected to grow once these treatments actually start. Shannon Smith, News 4.